Good day, students. Hope you are doing well today. Welcome to today's lecture with Antisela. The subject is commerce, class SS2. This is our ninth week. And our topic today is warehouse. Hope you are staying safe. Listen, take out anything that will be a distraction to you. Because by the end of this lesson, you are supposed to know how to define warehouse. And also tell me the importance of warehouse too. So make sure you off that television and listen to me. What is a warehouse? A warehouse is a place used for, for the storage of accumulated goods. Warehouse, warehousing is an act of storing goods that will be used or be sold later. We have, that means there is a difference between warehouse and warehousing. Warehouse is a building, is a place where goods are stored. But warehousing is an act of storing the goods in the warehouse. So why do people need warehouse? warehouse? Why do people store their goods? And that brings us to functions of warehouse. Under the functions of store warehouse, warehouse are used for storage, from the word storage, that means keeping. If there is mass production of, you like eating indomie, yes? I know. If there is a mass production of indomie from indomie company, if they won't sell everything as a go, they'll have to store some in order to sell them in future. So that is where warehouse and comes in. It's for storage, price stability. Most times they will tell you there are some things that are scarce in the market, therefore the price will high. The price will be high. Most times warehousing helps to curtail it because most of them are stored. If it is scarce, it will be brought out into the market. So the prices will go back to it. We have store they store surplus goods. If the goods are if the goods produced are surplus, you can store it in the warehouse in case, pending when it is needed. Packaging, grading of goods. You can repackage and grade goods in a warehouse. You keep it pending when you will need it or when you want to sell it. So importance of warehouse. The first one is that it provides storage for businessmen, for people, instead of leaving the goods maybe under the rain or under the sun so it will spoil if you really leave it under the rain or under the sun so it's better you store it in a warehouse so it will be there effective delivery that's number two if goods are stored in the warehouse that means whenever it is needed it will be delivered it's not when you will need a good a good you now start making cause for it to be brought to you, maybe they will say it is still going through processing and all that not. But once it is stored in a warehouse, immediately you need it, you go there and pick it. Prevent, it prevents price high. Once there are goods, there are no need to, for the prices of the goods to be high. It reduces damages. It helps for goods to be protected. If you leave it under the sun or the rain, it will damage. Warehousing. Warehousing is one of an aid to trade. It helps in storage and effective distribution of goods. I know you've done warehousing before. Yes, this one. Even did it in JS3. So I believe by now I should have refreshed your memory on warehousing. So you should ask yourself is warehousing important or not? And remember to do your assignments. List at least three important of warehouse. In your own words, define warehousing and warehouse.
and remember to submit your book when you are back. Download your notes. I say it again. Download the notes. It will help you to read so you won't stay idle at home. You can also ask your parents to go to the market and buy essential commerce for you. You can read the textbook book with it. It will also help you. So you can be at home and learn. Remember to stay safe and take care of yourself. Bye. Hey,